Hello and welcome to On Location with Scott. I'm Scott. I was on the back roads of Arizona early in the morning and I had to stop because a couple of abandoned buildings. So let's go take a look. Okay, I forgot my um, Crane M2 gimbal, so I'm going to do this all handheld. Hopefully it's not too shaky, but you never know. Okay, let's check out this first building and see what's what. This is obviously the main entrance. been the sink or the kitchen. All right? And you can see I'm in the middle of a highway there. And this well this is probably the main living room. So nothing right now. There's the old shower thing. Electrical plug on the wall, a window. Let's go this way. That would have been your closet. Wow. Looks like it was a nice bathroom at one time. Right? Marble. Tile there. And uh, no roof. Okay. So that would mean this was probably be a bedroom. Lots of windows for a little house. Lots of windows for a little house. That would be the closet there. Again, I'm wearing a pretty big closet. And no roof. Okay, let's go this way. And this would probably be a second bedroom. Yeah, a second bedroom. Again, no roof. <laughs> Not in this building anyway. And that would be the second closet, a little smaller than the first. So this wouldn't be the main bedroom, it would have been the other one. That's it for this building. Although they had gas and it shut off. So I wonder if, in fact, if you turn that, gas would come out. No, it's off. I can do that because I'm a natural gas specialist. Okay, a little windy today too. We'll head over to the next one. Let's see what this house has to bring. You can see there's nothing but farm fields in the background over there. Covered porch. This would probably be go back over this way, this would probably be the covered garage area, and over this way would be the house, front door and side door here. So we'll go into this side door and it's obviously a kitchen, right? All particle board cupboards, sink, tap. If you look here, the windows have all been cracked out. Lots of cars going by, but it's in the middle of fields everywhere. And it's early morning, so let's go into the living room. So I think this is the living room. Yep. There's the main door right here. Okay. Pretty much the same design as the other house. This one has a door on it that uh, for the closet. And this one was a little bigger, it had a bathtub in it that looks like blood. Is that blood? Do I want to know? toilet and look to see what's in there but like look at these walls 
All blood. Something very bad happened in here. Okay, tell me that's not blood. That looked like blood drops to me right there. Does that look like blood, blood drops to you? Like that just looks like blood splatter. Right out of Dexter. Look at that on the black wall. And look at this one here. How does it get like that if it's not blood? This is right out of Dexter. This is just amazing. Old plastic tube in for a shower curtain. Look at that. It's dripped right down and I don't even want to open that toilet. I'm not going to open that toilet. Usually I do to see what's there. Not today. That looks like blood splatter everywhere. Wow. Is this a murder scene? Was it a murder scene? I don't know. Okay, look at that. This would be the main building. Same layout as the other house. all taped up. Wow. Oh, and this one had cupboards over here. So let's see what's in here. Well, that's the end of this explore. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I was really freaked out when I went in that bathroom. It looked like blood was splattered all over. All over that bathroom. Uh, it was just amazing. Well, I don't know if there was a murder there. If there was, that's pretty creepy. Or if it was just, I don't know, water and some kind of uh, food coloring with it or something. But it looked like blood to me. And some of the spatter was amazing. So, well, that's it. Until I see you again, cheers.